Hey, this is Heather with TwoBlooms.com here to show you a quick and colorful golden hour edit right here in Lightroom. This is the photo that I'm going to be using today to demonstrate this edit, and this is going to be the end result. Very bold, very colorful, very crisp and clean. So let's get started right away. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to crop this image just so slightly, just to get him in the rule of thirds area. That's about good. And what I do to every single photo that I edit, um, I usually start with a preset or some sharpening. So I'm gonna come over here to my presets that I have already. You can use any preset that you want, hand edit that you want. I'm going to be reaching for my storyteller presets. I love these presets because they kind of give you that film look, but also colorful as well. So I'm going to be starting with the ST12 preset. This one's very crisp and beautiful. So after that preset, obviously we still need some work to get it more colorful. I'm going to adjust the white balance just a smidge, just to make it a little bit more um, warmed up. Because this is golden hour, it's sunset, we want him to glow. We don't want any kind of blue in the image. And I'm also going to adjust the exposure. It's very, very bright. Um, I could leave it as is, but I liked my images to be a little bit more on the deeper side and then add brightness in where I want them. So this is just personal preference. And then maybe add a little contrast. That's good. Contrast is good. Everything looks good here. Maybe add in a little bit more blacks just to deepen it just a little bit. There we go. And after that, I'm going to scroll up to my Storyteller presets again and just click Sharpen and we'll do a round vignette. This just adds some extra contrast around the edges and focuses more on the subject of the photo. Okay, so now we have our base edit done. Maybe add a little bit more warmth to the photo. Yeah, that looks good. So what I really want to do is add some color to the sunset. This is golden hour. You can see before and after. It's pretty washed out. And that's because my lighting wasn't really that great. My camera angle wasn't the best. But, you know, when you're photographing toddlers, sometimes that's going to happen. So I want to show you how to compensate for that. So I'm going to click on my masking button. If you don't have these options, just click on your brush option because we're going to be using a brush. So with this mask, I'm going to create new mask. Oh, we already have one. Um, and then I'm going to be showing you how to create like your own sun burst effect. So I'm going to come down here to the little color chooser, just pick like a really pretty orange, deep orange color and adjust the exposure just ever so slightly. We can adjust this afterwards and I'm going to make my brush pretty big. Now I'm just doing this on the scroller of my mouse. You can come up here and do the same over here, but I'm just going to kind of go over the areas that I want to turn the color. Now obviously this looks a little bit red, so I don't want red in my sunset. I want it more orange. So I'm going to come over here and just kind of adjust it. Maybe turn it towards the yellow side a little bit. Yeah. And that looks pretty good. I can come in here and just add a little bit more. And you can see We want to hide that before and after. I personally like the color. It just adds a little bit more flair. But when you're done, just click done. And there you have it. A very quick, very easy, colorful, contrasty, golden hour edit. If this was helpful, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and make sure you check out my website for more tutorials more Lightroom tips, and Lightroom presets. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.